Yo, what's up, rappers, and welcome to I'm a nun and I give milk to very needy people. Let's go to part 69. So now we are dressed properly to serve at this bar. I don't know what kind of bar it is, but let's go. This is a sir, this. Oh, it fits you like a glove. <laughs> like a glove? No, well, it's a bit too small. Why do I have to wear a swimsuit indoors while serving at the bar, nonetheless? It's a micro bikini. You need to wear this as fan service for our milk customers. How can you not know that, even though you're poor words? Oh yeah, I forgot, pafu pafu. Whatever, it doesn't matter, the customers will be coming soon. Yeah, all over my f Hey, little boy, wash those dishes. Yeah, you get out of here. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, there's plenty of customers though. Wow. Ha ha ha. Dan Mizu was the he's working at the bar. Hey, boss, you are the good one this time. I'm done with this. Hey, preferred woman, bring us some beer. Woo. I have a mild glass of water as well here. Pretty nice. Yeah, yes! I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm rushing! Eh. Yeah, but please stop! Hey, Miss Perf, I want beer too! Yes, coming right up! Wow, I feel so, so dirty right now. Oh, Miss! Wow! What is happening? Hey, show me the goods again! Oh, no! Yeah! The, the dear customer, no, please stop! Stop treating them with respect! They're not treating you with respect at all, Cecilia! Haha, <laughs> what? It's fine, right? The dear customer, who? Oh, Oh, your uh, hey man, check this out. Hey miss, I want to order too. You want to order those of clams? Dear customer, don't call the other customers here. What? Oh come on! How rude! Would have known that people in this island are all rude. <laughs> come on, miss, see faster. Yes, I'll be right there. I'll be everywhere. Oh, is that preferred that girl? What will your order be, dear customer? I want to drink up. Your... <laughs> That's gonna cost you a lot. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what you're supposed to order. <laughs> I think he knows pretty well what he ordered. I can bring it to you if you like. E excuse me? Do you know hear me? You produce that daily, right? Let me drink it. Eh? Dear customer, I'm very sorry, but... Shut up, just do it. Oh, oh. S -s Sir? Cecilia went to the innkeeper and asked for help. Do you really think he's gonna help you? After he put you in those clothes? However, he signaled her to do what he said. Oh, can I be the one doing it? No, no way. Hey, how can you keep a customer waiting? Hurry up. If this continues, the customer will become angrier and won't be able to stay here. Ah, uh, I understand. Maybe a beer mug. Oh, I've got an idea. You there. Bring what you're holding here. Ah, huh? come over here. Hey, do as he says. Uh, poor Marco. Bring it here, Marco. Ah, uh, oh, poor little boy. <laughs> Did I not tell you to bring it here? I'll punch you why would you punch a little kid marco do what he says no okay oh no oh he's about to punch marco what the f are they going to make me do this in front of marco you have done everything in front of him you know that right hey start <laughs> in that already <laughs> Cecilia was hesitating, but she wanted to finish this quickly so that Marco wouldn't have to endure this anymore because he's the one suffering. No one is actually suffering in here, except Cecilia. Ah? Like, is there no regulations in this town? I know that the soldiers are as bad as these guys, but either way, where are all the good people? What's the matter? And let it all out! Ah, uh, uh. Ooh, some lemon juice. Oh, I love it. The silly body trampled a bit. Ooh, I'm a lemon juice factory. Oh, holy. Hey, everyone, look. <laughs> you have to drink more water, Cecilia. Hydrate ourselves, guys. Uh, hey, Brad, why are your hands trampling so much? Yeah. <laughs> this is a spectacle. Don't spill it. <laughs> wow, this is a good show for you, isn't it? Uh, uh, you just, Cecilia. Oh. Finger licking good. Because of the added weight, the mug got heavier, so Marco's hands wouldn't stop trembling. Ah, ah, oh my god, so much liquid! Ah. This is bad, he's about to drop the mug. Give it to me! I asked for this, so I won't let it go into waste. To Cecilia's and Marco's embarrassment, the crazy man grabbed and drank the lemon juice. Shame on all of you. And we're done for today. Now you can go upstairs. Your room is at the end of the second floor. Also, here's your payment for working here. 250 golds? Okay. Thank you, now then, we will go and rest. Good work, Marco. Let's go to the second floor now. Let's get out of here. Oh, there's actually people 
stay here. Can I talk to them? Until a few minutes ago, it was so noisy downstairs. Do you know what happened? I have no idea. Yeah, are you that expressionist? Uh, maybe. Yeah, you're that woman who was walking down down without a skirt. Don't get close to me, you sick pervert. Uh, poor Cecilia. So, the end. Hey, wait, wait. Oh, no, it's coming back. It's coming back. No, go inside. <laughs> Thanks for before. Hey, you. You know what I'm talking about, right? That yellow liquid you train from a mug. Huh? You mean beer? Nope. <laughs> That's what everyone will think, right? What is he saying? However, the right answer is this woman's... Ah! No, it's not. You want to see it too, don't you? Hey, come on. What is he doing? Hey, can you... Uh right now? Just a bit. <laughs> Let's go to our room now, Marco. Okay. No. Can you smell it? <laughs> uh, yeah, just sleep on it. You're gonna feel better next day. So many things happened yesterday. She looks so happy when saying this. But we need to stay strong and do our best. Follow your dreams. Ah, the smell of honey and peace by the morning. Indeed, what a sweet smell. Huh? Young man, who's this? Um, are you selling honey? How much do you want for it? Haha, <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's not for sale. Ah, I see. This is for the people that live in the poor parts of this town. I'm riding my carriage there right now. I want to distribute it to them. It's not honey, is it? It's little children. Not just honey. I have oranges, apples, grapes, and other fruits as well. Oh my, what a splendid action. Haha, <laughs> that's the only thing I can do for those poor people. By the way, are you two travelers? How about it? Want to come with me? As you can see, I'm carrying a lot of things. Are you certain that we can come? Ah, of course. It'll be great to have some help. Oh, how about I give you this small bottle of honey as a token of my gratitude? Honey is very valuable around here. Ah, I'm so happy. Oof, oof, oof. Good for you, Marco. All right, time to go. Come, you two. Get on. Oh, no. Is he going to chloroform Marco? All right, then let's go. Or maybe he did poison him. Okay. We should know by now to not trust anyone in this town, especially men. Can you lift it? Is it heavy? Yep, I can. Haha, <laughs> good. As expected of a boy as lively as you are. Just push it. All right, leave them here. Thank you for your help. Leave them here? Who's them? Now he's going to take off body parts. <laughs> and now... The man took a bell out of his chest and rang it. Hey, you damn pigs, I brought food. What is happening, eh? Eh? Um, what did you just say? Good, farm a line. Is that the kidnapped children? <laughs> I brought food to you piggies today as well. What, what, what are you saying? Man from the slums. <laughs> ah, he reeks. Hey, not yet. Standing in the proper line. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Here we go. Here we go. Are we supposed to be the food or what's inside the chest? The men started throwing fruits to the people from the slums. The fruits hit the ground and cracked, splashing the whole area. Yes. Now eat. <laughs> <laughs> food. <laughs> As the man raised his voice, all those people ran to the fruits and started hitting them. They didn't care about the dirt. All they wanted was to eat. Ha <laughs> yes, eat them all! Okay. The man kept throwing more fruits while laughing. Ha 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 ha! Hey, don't use your hands. Only use your mouths, like cattles. If you don't, I'll stop giving them to you. Ha 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 ha! So this must be the man who kidnaps the children. How can you do this? Stop throwing them food like that. That's right, mister. Stop doing such a horrible thing. What are you talking about? I don't need your preaching. If you keep doing something like this, God will punish you. Stop it at once. God hasn't punished anyone by now. He's not gonna punish this guy. The man looked coldly at her. God? What are you talking about? I am rich. No one can punish me. Yeah. Then you must punish yourself. Don't you have a conscience? Why would I punish myself? I have the right to do whatever I want. That doesn't give you the right to do everything you want. Unless you can buy that. Anyway, just stop it. What an annoying woman. Uh-oh. Oh, no. He had an idea. Ah, I thought of something good. Okay, come over here. Yeah! How oh, dare you touch this? There. All right, little piggies. If you st I'll give you a honey. Oh, seriously? We are in trouble. Nah, honey. <laughs> Yes, get her. M Mister, stop it. Shut up. Marco. Oh, no. Has he done something with Marco? The man from the slums threw away the broken fruits and immediately grabbed Cecilia. No, stop it, please. Sis, no. Oh, is that honey? Here, it's honey. What are you? Ah, it's cold. All right, then, piggies. Ooh. Okay, that is disgusting. Yeah. Ooh. No, no, no. 
Oh, there's more. Here you go. It's so cold. Yes, stop. Haha. <laughs> well, isn't it delicious? Here's the last bottle. Yeah, not there. No, stop. Shut up. Oh, no. Mm -mm. That's a no-no for me. Honey with fish? Ew. No, thank you. Not a part of my menu. It's time to stop. Ahaha, <laughs> what a nice sound. This is so funny. Ha <laughs> Just punch everyone. Jesus Christ, Cecilia. So Cecilia started to feel weird. When the people from the slum finally let Cecilia free, there was no trace of honey. Well, good, at least I'm clean now. That was my base of the year. Ha, hey, you little dirty piggies. The man kicked the crate with the remaining fruits down. <laughs> Today was fun. I knew it was the right choice to bring you with me. Now get out of here. I'm glad that I stand up to this guy. <laughs> Wasn't that really funny? Watching the poor be so angry is always entertaining. <laughs> I'm going home now. I, I promise I'll give you some honey, didn't I? I totally forgot about that so i spill it all over ha 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 too bad bye now well i am glad that that happened the man got on his wagon and left i guess we didn't get any honey marco yeah so sorry about that it's fine it's just so funny that they end up all happy and positive after everything that they go through i see let's go now okay okay i guess that's it for this episode of the promise rosary I hope you guys enjoyed this honey episode it was a little bit disgusting and cringe say goody goody guys and of course Bye.